There is evidence that the Gaelic kingdom of Dal Riata was established in the 5th century by King Fergus More, Fergus the Great. The kingdom was located on the western seaboard of Scotland, and the northeastern coast of Ireland, on either side of the North Channel. It consisted of four main kindreds, each with its own chief, Senel N. Gaybrain, based in Kintyre, Senel Nengusa, based on Isla, Senel Loen, who gave their name to the district of Lorne, and Senel Cumgale, who gave their name to Cowell. The capital of Dol Riata was believed to be the hill fort of Dunad, and other important royal forts included Dunolly, Dunaverti, and Dunsevric. The kingdom of Dol Riata was known for its seafaring culture and large naval fleet. It was also home to the important monastery of Iona, which played a key role in the spread of Celtic Christianity, and the development of insular art. Iona was a center of learning and produced many important manuscripts. During the reign of King Aidan Mac Gaybrain, 574-608, Dol Riata experienced a period of expansion. The kingdom carried out naval expeditions to Orkney and the Isle of Man, and made attacks on the Britannic kingdom of Strathclyde and the Anglian kingdom of Bernicia. However, the growth of Dol Riata was checked by King Ethelfrith of Bernicia at the Battle of Degsaston in 603. In the 7th century, Dol Riata suffered serious defeats in Ireland and Scotland during the reign of Domnolbrec, died 642, marking the end of the kingdom's golden age. Dol Riata became a client of Northumbria for a time. In the 730s, the Pictish king Angus I led campaigns against Dol Riata, and brought it under Pictish overlordship by 741. There is disagreement among scholars about the fate of Dol Riata after this point. Some believe that the kingdom experienced a revival under King A, 736-778, while others see it as having effectively come to an end. Some even suggest that Dol Riata may have usurped the kingship of Fortriu. From the late 8th century onward, there were sporadic Viking raids in Dol Riata. In the following century, there may have been a merger of the Dol Riatan and Pictish crowns. Some sources indicate that Kenet Mac Aelpin, Kenneth MacAlpin, was king of Dol Riata before becoming king of the Picts in 843, following a major defeat of the Picts by Vikings. The kingdom of Dol Riata eventually merged with Pictland to form the kingdom of Alba.